This lionfish will eventually kill this grouper. Thing is a psycho. That's a beard. It's literally Fu Manchu. No! Oh! oh my god, the thing is big, dude. He looks big in here. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. And uh, today, we're doing something really, really awesome. We're getting a new fish for our 125 gallon saltwater tank. And uh, we are saving this fish. You guys are gonna see in just a second the whole situation that he's in. But this fish is one that we've wanted for so long. He is super colorful, really, really pretty fish, and we are super happy to have him. So uh, let's jump right into the video, and uh, you guys can go see this fish they're about to get. But first, uh, let me talk about the giveaway once again. Google Mini Home. So uh, if you want to enter this giveaway, I've never used one of these things, but uh, I know a lot of people like them. So if you guys want to enter, just hit the subscribe button, turn that post notification bell on. And uh, like this video if you want a double entry, go check out our Instagram, that'll be right here. But anyways guys, let's hop into this video and check out this awesome, awesome fish that we just got. All right guys, we're on our way to Will's house to save this Miniana Scrooper. Let's go get him. Okay guys, this is the tank we are saving this Miniana Scrooper from. Look at the size of this lionfish. He is ginormous, okay? That's my hand. He is huge. I'm sorry, he is huge. The Miniata grouper is back there, it's nice and orange. This lionfish will eventually kill this grouper. If this grouper runs into his spikes, this lionfish has poisonous spikes on top of him and he is huge compared to this guy. This is a big fish back here. Bo, hello, thank you, nice to meet you. That's Will's dog. But you will see this grouper a much better way when he, once he's in my tank, but because he's hiding under the rocks right now, but this lionfish is absolutely huge. Look at this thing up close. We are saving this grouper from this lionfish and we're going to give him a beautiful, beautiful new home. He is such an awesome fish. Look how orange and bright he is down there. He's going to eat like crazy and he's going to fit in super good with this eel. Dude, this lionfish is huge, Will. I love it. So, this thing is a psycho. That's a beard. It was a lot worse. It's literally Fu Manchu. Look at this. Let me, just, let me twist your beard hairs. <laughs> This thing, this thing is huge, bro. Alright, we're trying to get this mini out of here. It's time for a bigger old for him. Fish first. Well, you're gonna be able to see him really uh, nice when yeah. he's in our tank, but um, that's him back there. Now, let's get to work trying to get this thing out of here. So, Will's gonna have to put the lionfish into this bucket to make some space. And then um, then we can get the mini otis out. We definitely gotta get this big fish out of here because all those spines are poisonous and they could really do some damage. So, yeah. lionfish is going in there, mini otis in here. Right now, Will's going in for the kill on the lionfish. Right here. Well, how many years have you had this lionfish, dude? A lot four, of years. Like four Gs. Cause yeah, these things are, you're supposed to kill them, but Will's have this thing as a pepper. Very, oh my very God. Don't He's let crazy. that thing get out. That will kill. That would be very bad. Look at that guy. Okay. He's in there for now. Look at him. You better get out, cause you ain't touching that thing. There you go, All right, he's out. Let's get a little light on him. Let's check him out. Wow, that's actually such a pretty fish. Look at that. That is amazing. I think we maybe get a lionfish for our tank. But now, the mini otis scrooper. Gotta get him out. He's in that hole. He's probably not gonna come out. What do you think? He'll come out. You think? No shot. There's the shrimp. We're gonna try to tease him out with the shrimp. And uh, Bo wants a shrimp, but Bo no, it's not shrimp. for you, Bo. Yeah. Got this nice shrimp right here in the world of frosted. I'm just gonna take a little bit, little piece off of it, and I'm gonna drop it. We're gonna drop this little piece right here into the grouper's tank. Hopefully, he's gonna come out, and Will will test his ground ball skills here. We're really gonna see if he's gonna be able to get him. So let's drop this thing and see what he does. All right, he just ate that piece off camera. So let's see if he wants to come out for this one. Here he comes. Will, you better get that GB. Oh. Will, you better get that GB. Oh. Not a very good ground ball play right there, boys. Totally He'd be cut. If that was Coach, he is cut. He's never uh, seen the field ever. I hit the. I know. You time. got robbed. You got robbed. Should I just drop him this one? Yeah. Really, you had your chance. Very gentle. All right, do it again. Do it. It's such a big grouper, dude. I can't believe he's There's so much glare. Team, I know. There's a lot of glare. <clears throat> Oh! Oh! Will, he wants that, she wants that shrimp, dude. He really wants that shrimp. Oh. I'm having a good time right now. It's like man vs. wild, if you like, right? It is man vs. wild. Man vs. wild. Man, right, no. man vs. Uh, fish. Oh! 
Mother. No! Ready? That thing is fast! You, you got robbed. robbed me. <laughs> he got robbed. He thinks this is a game, dude. He, he no, loves this. Man versus wild, bro. Right now, wild is a little bit smarter. Oh, I was gonna go for the kill. I was, I was gonna Will. go. We're giving up on the food and the ground ball technique. Right now, we're blocking off some holes that he, so he can't get into them, and we're gonna go in with the net and get aggressive with him. We're gonna get him out. Yeah, Will bought an octopus the other day. Look at this thing. You can barely see it. It's attached to that rock right there. You guys can well, look at the difference right the there. That's an octopus. That's the octopus. Oh, he's changing color. Okay, now keep him over there. Dude, this put, net. Put the net on that side. You got me back. No! No! You no! Know, this thing is a wizard, dude. Jack, Jack, come over here. That's what we want. We want him, we want him there. That's a, that, that could be better. That could be better. Don't let him just jump out. Do not let him jump out. Okay, okay, okay. We got him. Let's go. Ready? Let's go. Gracefully. Look at that fish, guys. That is a beautiful fish. Hang on, let him calm down for a second. Everyone's hyped. We got the we got the Minionis. This camera is has water all over it. <laughs> all right, so the camera's about to die, so we're gonna head over to the crib. He's gonna be a little uh, little stressed out, a little darker in color right now. But uh, once we get that back to the house, we'll show you really what he looks like. The lionfish is back in. We have the Minionis grouper right there. We're gonna head home, and uh, this tank will clear up. And uh, huge thanks to Will for the Minionis grouper. Let's get home. All right, you guys, we have fed the eel, so he's not aggressive towards him, which should not be a problem at all, because Will's is probably about that big. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and put this thing in his new tank right now. It's orange, speckled blue, Miniatis grouper, who's been activating for about 20 minutes in the bucket. Here's the eel. So he's ready, he's right here, the eel's ready. The eel's a psycho. He's a psycho, but you guys will see us beat him soon. It's insane, but we're gonna have Will scoop out his grouper, put him in the tank, because Will's, Will's redoing his tank. He's getting all clowns. Comment down below if you guys want us to film Will redoing his tank, if it's cool with him, which, yeah, of course. It's, yeah, <laughs> so let us know in the comments down below. He's going to deck it out, and uh, yeah, drop a comment. So let's get this grouper in the tank. All right, Will's scooping him out. He's going in the tank. Let's get to it. This is Will's first. He's a little stressed right now. He's very pale. Oh, give, him a, give him like a day. He's going to be bright orange. You're going to grab Smart. Bye, buddy. Bye, buddy. Whee! Oh. It's fine. Now he's gonna go find his own. Now he's gonna sick chill. It oh my god, the thing is big, dude. He looks big in here. Find his cave. He's behind the tank. <laughs> he's behind here already. Uh oh, the eel sees him. The eel sees him. It's fine. The eel sees him. Let's check him out. These two together for the first time. See the eel up there? The eel's right there, checking him out. The grouper's definitely a little scared, obviously. Well, yeah, yeah. But um, he's he's gonna do perfect in here, and that eel is holding his own. We're gonna let him warm up just a little bit, and we'll roll a quick montage of our brand new grouper. All right guys, that is it for today's video. Uh, as you can see, he looks awesome in that tank. He's killer in that tank, absolutely. I love the colors, he's got the yellow fins with the uh, the orange and, and like blue spots. But um, yeah, that's a Miniatus grouper. So he's gonna he's gonna be super aggressive in there. This tank is, also, is already looking super aggressive. And uh, we're gonna be doing some feeding videos with them. First, we'll probably feed the eel, make a video about feeding the eel because he eats. You are not gonna wanna miss him eating. It's the coolest thing ever, I, I, it, by far. The best fish I've ever bought is that eel, by far, hands down, hands down. But the Miniatus also eats like crazy too, he just claps him off the surface. So um, stay tuned for later videos uh, on that. We're gonna show exactly what we're feeding them. You guys wanna see a live feeding, you know, we can always feed them live shrimp, damsels, whatever you guys think, they can eat it all. They'll literally eat anything. If I stick my hand in there, they'll try to eat my hand. So uh, yeah, they're pretty awesome and aggressive fish. Let us know down in the comments what else you guys wanna see in there, another grouper a puffer fish maybe so uh yeah that's gonna be it for today's video and we'll see you guys in the next one first <clears throat> oh god <laughs> that's yeah i got one i got that cheers hi bo hi bo hi hi i love you 
I love you. Thank you, that's my kneecap. Chris, you love to hump me right now. You yeah. love to hump me. You just hump me. Nice. <laughs>